mines. Right, talking of mines. Right, should we do that? Yeah, why not? Why not? Now, we've got an iron mine over here, and we've got another one. Where is it? There. Right, so we're going to crank these babies up. Now, I've already issued the edict. Right, so the amount left will have gone up. Um, like quite significantly. Let me j just check that I did. Yes, I did. There it is. Okay, so um, so we've got like 64,000 in here. We want to do the upgrades. Um, effectiveness increased, job quality decreased. Yeah, we'll take that. Uh, modernize them all. Um, yeah, I'm going to modernize both of these. All right, that's going to use up all that I've got though. But but that's okay. Right, so um, we've done that. Ah, these things are a bit annoying. Right, there we go. Uh, now, when you upgrade these, this is a tip. When you upgrade this, you've got to go back and redo the budget because it resets it to normal. I don't know why it does that, but it does. So, um, and that can catch you out. So make sure that you do that. Right, cash is still flooding in, which is good. We're back up to another 20 thou. So let's now go over to our coal mines, which I got rid of before. And uh, Oh, yeah, and somebody somebody pointed out to me. I've kind of never bothered with this, but um, let's just like, use this. If you right-click, it uh, tells you down here. If you right-click, um, you can actually just fire the workers. Right, So you don't have to mess around with the budgets. You don't have to demolish the buildings. You just right-click on those. Um, the amount of times I use it, though, is like virtually zero, to be honest. Right, coal deposits. Why isn't this giving me an office? Uh, uh, um. Oh, because I need to put a mine in. I was clicking on that and thinking, why isn't it giving me an upgrade op option? I need to build it. Right, so we're going to pop an automated mine there. And there's another coal. Where... Is it that one? Yes, it is. Right, we'll put another automated coal there. Right, so then uh, I'm going to crank these up to high priorities. Now, as soon as these um, these start producing, I'm going to bang in um, some more steel mills. I'm probably going to put two steel mills on each side. Now. Let's check out these guys. See, this has only got like, has this got less than four, 500 sugar in? This has got a couple of thousand. That's what I'd like to see. And there's one over here, isn't there? See, that's, yeah. If you've got two, three thousand in, looking comfortable. But I reckon this one, this one's going to like... Look, see, I was right. Look, it's run out. Right, so that's currently sitting there not producing. And that's a really bad thing. So we want to bang in another sugar plantation to make sure that we've got enough sugar so that they're running all the time. If your factories aren't running all the time, um, you're really going to struggle. Right, let's crank this up because we, we need some more cash again. Oh, man. How are we doing with our construction? Oh, stuff's starting to get built a bit quicker now. We're still... Oh, these are starting to get built. Starting to get built. Here comes the cash again. Good, good, good. Now, I'm only putting a sugar plantation in, so they're, they're very cheap. Um, plantation, select sugar. Otherwise, you'll forget, Sky. Um, where, can we put, where can we put a nice sugar plantation in? Yeah. What's this thing? This is blooming pineapples, isn't it? I'd really like to move that, to be absolutely we've You know what, I'm going to. Mineral oil. Whoa, we've discovered oil. Thank you, Penultimo. Um, you know what, I'm, I'm going to move this, because it's annoying me where it is. Right, come on. Knock it down. Thank you. Get rid of it. Good, good, good. Right, let's pop this um, sugar plantation in. So, sugar is selected. And I'm going to pop it in, I think... Yeah. What's this road spacing? Uh, no, the road spacing is correct for a sugar plantation that way. Do I want it, like, right in front of there? I wanted to put the embassies and stuff in there, didn't I? Yeah, I'll put it up this end then. Right, so, boom. New sugar plantation. Like, I'm seriously tempted to quick build it. But, um... 
because our construction oh, our construction's a bit slow. look at this traffic jam down here look at that right this is why I need to get this little bit of road sorted out right everywhere else not a problem there traffic jam and, and it's because we've got this one road coming along here and there's nothing else going on we need to um, need to get this going a bit more oh look look at the cash boom 50,000 right you know what let's put in um, some more teamsters over here so that we start shipping stuff out through these docks a bit more effectively uh, teamsters so I want to flip that round there put that guy in there and I think uh, let's see you probably want something along the lines of two teamsters for each dock but you've kind of it, it's not as simple as that you've got to look at the other industries you've got how close they are all those kinds of things but I'm gonna put some more of those guys in come on there we go all the construction workers going out now Let's watch the construction workers for a second come on Oh no, those are, those are Teamsters going in there. Where's the construction workers? What are you all doing? They're going off for a tea break or something? I don't know. Alrighty. Cool, cool, cool. Right. Um, how are we doing? We've got the coal mines in and the iron mines, haven't we? Right. Oh, yeah, that's just got built. Excellent. We can do the upgrades for this now. So, Rock Breaker increases the uh, the available amount of resources. We'll do that, like, straight away. Coal Prep Plant increases workers by 3 and effectiveness by 30. This is, I don't think, a fabulous idea. It takes up more workers, and it means that you, you just uh, deplete your resources faster. And it's not a fantastic um, increase. So um, I don't actually recommend that one. Now, see, we've upgraded. We've we, we've put these in as new ones, but same with the upgrade. We need to redo that. So that's done that, and that should be the same over here. Put this coal. Uh, yeah, rock breaker. Yes, coal preparation plant. No. What's that? That's a bauxite mine, isn't it? Right. While I'm here, get me a little extractor. No. Right, I'm not going to modernise this because I want to save this for um, vehicle plants that we'll get to in a while. Uh, heavy Crusher. Uh, rock Breaker I definitely want. Heavy Crusher, do I want that? Yeah, you know what, I'm going to take that one. Did I put that one in over here? Yes, I did. Rock Breaker, President, I didn't. That's it. Remember that show where oh, we okay, we've execute. unlocked some more research. Good, good, good. Oh, cash is up to over 60,000 now. I love it when I'm spending money and it's still going up. I like that. Okay, so how how are our docks doing over it? Yeah, we're, we're shipping stuff out. We're shipping out like iron, bananas. Um, oh, here we've got like fish, iron, corn, bananas. So we're shipping some of that stuff out that's clogging up our docks. This is a good thing cash is still going up right now I think is a good time to start so oh we've got a rebel attack oh awesome oh we've got a couple of tasks down here which I haven't picked up Let me, um, export 5,000 pharmaceuticals now that's a good thing because I want to do the whole pharmaceutical thing but we'll talk about that in a little while what's this one build a bank and we can do that as well so that's good Right, so the rebels are attacking now. Where are they? There's, there's a guy down here. There's probably are there some over here. Yeah, it looks like it's just that one guy. Well, he's going to get a nasty Great shot because we've got tropical spiders, President. Oh, expect giant tropical spiders. Expect larger rebel uh, larger rebel operations. Um, we've got like two lots of tanks, four lots of infantry at the moment. These are taking and like an inordinate amount of time to build. Like, what is going on? Like, I'm almost tempted to like knock them down and rebuild them because they look like they're stuck. Okay, folks, show's over. Oh, it's, it's Lulu. Lulu. Time, no? Some shots were fired, some words were said. If you're not dead or in prison or both, 
Come down to yeah, the thank you, Lulu. Roger and bury the hatchet. Get down to the Jolly Roger. Right, what was I doing? I was putting in um, some um, steel plants, wasn't I? Yes, I was. Right. Yeah, just before I do it, let's look at the resources again. So let's go up to economy, resource overview, and let's look at our coal and iron situation. So coal, we produced 19,000. We only consumed 1,000 of it. Iron produced 11,000, only consumed 5,000 on it of it. Cool, excellent. So we've got lots of room to put in some more steel mills. Right, well, where industry? That's what I'm looking for. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put... And this is something I've noticed. I think that the Teamsters seem to supply factories better. If you don't have factories of the same type together, if they're actually spread out a bit, it's... I, like maybe it's just me, but I seem to get better results doing that. Right, I'm going to put one guy there, and I think I'm going to put one guy there. So I need to extend that road a little bit. Let's do that. Pop a road out there. Yeah, go straight. That'll do nicely. Right, so we've got that guy there. Um, so we've got two there. I still want to put another one over this side, don't I? Yes, I do. Um, I did. I put, I put the extra sugar in. Yeah, I did. Oh, I didn't do the upgrade. There we go. I knew there was something I'd forgotten about the sugar. It was nagging me. I was like going, Sky, you've forgotten something. Sky, you've forgotten something. All right. Let's put in. Where's our steel mills again? I want to put a steel mill in, but I don't want to put it. I don't really want to put it next to that. I might end up putting it next to that, but I'd prefer to put it like on this side. But it's it's getting a bit close to this. But you know what? I'm going to do it anyway because it 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 kind of start helps to balance these two roads out, which I think is a good idea. And if I can if I can get another road like maybe across here in some fashion it will be better. Right, let's pop you in there. Good. Right, I'm going to make that a high priority. And, uh, oh, well, these are, these are almost built anyway. Elections are coming, President. Oh, elections are coming. As Look, see, I told you if I didn't do anything, that this was going to drop right down to about 50%, and what a surprise, that's exactly what's happened. Now, because we're utilising our economic resources, I'm going to go with Placido, who's got the magnet ability. And uh, that means we'll deplete our race resources slower. Okay, elections are in 12 months. We kind of need to do something about this, guys. Okay, yeah, they're, they're both getting built. Both looking good. Oh, no, this one. Let's make that high priority as well. Come on, guys. Get construct. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's more like it. Oh, I've just remembered something that it I did want to show you. Democracy. But okay, we've got proof. democracy options. Um, what do we want? What do we want? Okay, we're going to go with... Um, uh, am I going to go with open society? Ooh, oh, 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 oh. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. You know what? I'm going to leave those just for a while, just till I get this happiness back up. Yeah. Um, uh, you know what? It forces you to choose them now. Oh, man. All right. Uh, so, damn. You know, I'm going to go with security surveillance for now. Because um, this, this era, you get lo lots of rebel attacks and stuff, so it would be cool to uh, to have that. The um, economy structure, I'm going to go with free market. And for media independence, we're going to go with... Um, we're gonna, I think we're going to go with the the subsidised media for now. What I'd like to do at the end is, is get it like completely free. Okay? You know, but um, but we'll see. We need to get some people happy. So what I was going to do um, before, actually, you know what? I got distracted because my I'm using a wireless mouse and the battery died, so I had to replace <laughs> I had to replace it. Sorry about that. Alrighty. So police stations. That's what I was going to do first. 
Um, there's a couple of upgrades on these police stations. This radio dispatch increases the area that's serviced, uh, which is definitely a good thing. And I'm going to put in the, the fire brigades while we're here. Right, so that's that one. Uh, also, while I'm here, I'm going to upgrade the clinics. Now, I, I'm sorry, I, in one of the earlier videos, I said the clinics had, um, 50, uh, took 50 people, which is complete nonsense. It's 100, and you can upgrade them. Uh, with this hospitalization wing to take 150. So four hospitals will deal with 600 people, which is, we've got four at the moment. That's not enough, so I actually need to put in a couple more to uh, to get that sorted out. Right, so we've done that on this side. We now need to do the same thing on the other side. So where's where did I put the police station? Is that it? Yeah, there's, there's the police station. So we'll bang in these upgrades, and then there's a clinic there upgrade that. I'm not doing the birth rate increases at the moment because we're getting tons of people coming to the island so kind of don't need to do it. Right, done that. Right, I'm going to pop in a couple more clinics then and I may even pop in a couple of more police stations or at least maybe one, we'll see. But we definitely need a couple of more clinics. I'm going to put one there and I'm going to try and find a a space to squeeze one in over here. Now I could just put it there, which you know fits, but I, I kind of want to spread them out a little bit, so I'm going to put it, I think, over this side. I'm going to spin it around that way. Yeah, let's pop it in there. Cool. Right, let's. Um, yeah, I'm just, like so tempted to just quick build that. You know what? I'm going to. I'm going to quick build that. And, we have oh. an opportunity to oh. influence the outcome of coming elections. Yeah, see, as soon as we start doing these things, exactly this just bounces back up. We can win without cheating. We don't need to cheat. We're a, my people love me. I'm a beneficial dictator. Um, what the hell was I doing? Oh yeah, I was upgrading the killer leaks. I man, kitten, ball of string. I'm so easily distracted. Alrighty, let's um, let's quit build that one. Come on, get done. And then I can throw in that. I am so oh, curious. can't afford the expense. What just Rebels are attacking again. Now we've got a couple of guys coming in. They're coming in from one of the docks. Where are they? Where are they? Can't see. You know what? Oh, there they are. Oh, pff. Yeah, you attacked the wrong place. Our boys just took them apart. These things just aren't building. I wonder if they're a bit bugged out. I think there's definitely a problem. Alrighty, uh, now I was doing something, can't remember what the hell it was. See, that's not getting built. Why is that not getting built? You know what, I'm, these ones that aren't getting built, that have been there for ages, I'm actually going to get rid of and I'm going to rebuild them. Um, I'm going to cancel that one. Oh. I only get 2,900 back. Are you kidding me? Why don't you build these blooming things? I mean, if I change the priority. Oh, great time for an auto save. Thanks for that. Let's try changing the priorities, see if they get done. But there's something get weird going on with these. I, I don't understand why they're not getting built. Okay, there is something that we kind of need to do now. Now, having the military in the centre of the island, on, on a big island like this, is kind of cool, because it means that they've you can put them in, all in one place, and they've kind of got the minimum, minimum distance to get to any place on the island. But you need something that's going to slow down the, the rebels, because if they come on onto the beach, and then, like decide they're going to take out one of your factories your troops have got a long ass way to come and it's easy to lose factories um, to the rebels now that's kind of not the end of the world and to be honest as long as they don't take out your presidential palace it's really not that much of a problem and we're making enough money that it's not going to be an issue but I think it's a good idea to just bang in some guard towers to protect your um, your factories and, and dockyard areas. So what I'm gonna do? Uh, I'm so tempted. I'm so tempted to just move this blooming cotton plantation. Um, 
but you know I'll I'll live with it. Right, I'm going to put two in there, and I'm going to put two in there. You want them in groups, and like the more there are together, the better, because it will delay the um, the guys. And and to be honest, it'll kill a lot of them if you like if you put in a group of eight of these and upgrade them. Pff, they really they'll 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 stop a lot of troops. You'll be surprised. I'm going to do the same thing over here as well. Um, well, I've got a nice gap there. I'm going to put in. I'm going to put three on that side, and I'm going to put. Uh, one, I'm going to put a group of four on that side. So four on that side, three on that side. You know what? No, you know what the hell? I'm going to put four on that side, four on that side. What did I do down here? I put in. I put in four there, didn't I? Um, man, man, that blooming cotton plantation is. Re I, I forgot to leave one space in front of it when I when I placed them. Annoying. And you, uh, I mean, I could put a couple over here, but you know what? I'm actually gonna like. Ah, oh, I can't. I can't. I really want to put them on this side. I want to put like put a group of four on this side. But I can't because of this stupid cotton plantation. Um, shall I put them on this side? That's kind of a bit out of the way, though. Uh, I could put a couple more in, like here, I guess. Yeah, I'll I'll put two more in there. So we've got six. Right. Um, they will take a little bit of a time to build. We've got some more tasks we can pick up. Build a hotel. I don't mind doing that. Export 5,000 rum. Well, that's not a problem, so we'll definitely do that. Cool. This thing hasn't got built either. Let's change the priority on that and see if this actually gets built. That's still 82. That's 84. That's been like 84 for years. We forget months. That's been like, like sitting there for just ages and ages. And so is this. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna cancel the construction. Look, I only get seven seventy back. Huh. Because the thing's almost built, it's just not getting finished. That that seems that seems a bit off to me. If any if any of you guys have got any tips for this, if you've seen this before, if you know how to like fix it maybe, then let me know. 